72% of you guys watching my videos right now are actually not even subscribed. So why not subscribe? It's free and it helps the channel out. Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. I've officially given up with Warzone. It is driving me absolutely insane. So we're back playing multiplayer and I have a very, very special class up for you guys. Before we do hop into the class up, make sure you guys are smashing the like on this video and make sure you are hitting that subscribe button as well for more daily Call of Duty content, just for what you're about to see. But anyway guys, as you can see on your screens right now, we have the ACR class up. This thing is an absolute laser, it literally has zero recoil. And if you didn't know, it's actually the kilo, but using these attachments, make it pretty much into the ACR. I would say closest to Modern Warfare 3 ACR than the Modern Warfare 2 version. But if you didn't know, guns in this game, depending on what attachments you put on them, you can actually transform them into different guns. There's loads. I've covered a few already. And if actually, if you've been subscribed for a longish time, you'll know I've already covered this gun way back in November when this game was released, when people first started finding out about these different variants. I actually covered the ACR and it's nearly at 300 views actually, so it did pretty well. Uh, and I'm recovering it today, an updated version. Now the game is, you know, pretty much at its full peak in a life cycle. But anyway, hopping straight into the attachments, we have the Singard Arms Whisper. The reason I've gone for this, it adds a suppressor onto the weapon. And if you wasn't rocking a suppressor on your ACR back in Modern Warfare 3, you was definitely doing it wrong. We have the GI Mini Reflex. Uh, the 60 round mags, stipple grip tape, and of course fully loaded as I always do. This class setup is actually surprisingly very, very good, and this was actually my favourite gun in the game right at the very start. It's all I used to use this setup until I went and found the MP5, that is. But it absolutely melts people. Absolute laser, zero recoil. Honestly, you'll do so well with this class setup. Make sure you do put it on for yourself. Anyway, guys, we're gonna hop straight into a game right now and absolutely melt people with this ACR. Okay, guys, we've got a little kill confirmed on Shoe House. If you didn't know, I think I've already mentioned it, Shoe House actually, what the hell, I've been spotted already, what is this guy doing with the spotted grenades? Shoe House is actually my favourite map in this game, and this is one of my favourite weapons in this game. There's another spotter grenade, what is this kid doing? Is it the same guy? It must have been the same guy. Get out of here. And you, see you later mate. And you, goodbye. This gun absolutely melts, honestly, you'd be so surprised. And I find often that these weird class sort of variants that you can actually get in the game, like hidden weapons if you will, see, uh, they're actually pretty decent. Uh, they're really surprising of how good they actually can be. We're literally one kill off of VTOL right now, I think, as well, already. Pretty shredding with this thing. But I've pretty much given up with Warzone. I've played, like, I don't know, pretty much all morning. And I'm getting in the top 10 most games. And pretty much just getting sniped every single game. I'm going to post a clip on my Instagram, so follow me over on there, on, the tw on my Twitter. Uh, I knocked someone with a sniper, and it took three bullets with the AX50. Three bullets to the body to finish him off. It was unreal. One hit to down him, three shots to finish him off. I, I was like, what is going off? It's just crazy, man. Warzone, oh my days, goodbye, you're not killing me. I've got no steam, oh my god. I thought we'd have had the VTOL, it looks like we've one more kill off. Hopefully we can get the advance as well, you know, you know, I'm infamous, oh my days. I'm infamous for choking the advance. We've got a VTOL, let's get the advance, baby. Let's get it in. This guy up here, I think. Where's this kid going? Where are you, my friend? Goodbye. Oh my days, I've got no stim, this is annoying, there's a guy in this corner. I, oh my days, I should not have challenged him with no stim shot, or, well, whilst I was weak. I was so stupid, I'm going to drop the VTOL mid-map. But yeah, I think I'm going to be giving up with Warzone. Uh, I've got three videos, I've got two Battle Royales and a Plunder gameplay. I came like third in Plunder, solo. Uh, it was pretty decent gameplay to be fair, but Plunder is just awful and... I just don't think I'm a Battle Royale kind of guy, to be honest. I, I, there's a kid to my left. Okay, he disappeared off the UAV. What? He was on, oh my, okay. I don't know how, why this guy disappeared. Must be using Ghost and just started moving. I have no idea. Oh my days, no! <laughs> Where did this kid run from? He was just sat in that corner by the looks of things. Oh my days. Yeah, it's super annoying. I just, oh my life. My teammate goes one way, enemy goes the other. That is so unfortunate. But it's just so stressful. I mean, I'm half decent. I just can't get a win. I think it's because it's stimulus solos. Oh, there's a guy in that head glitch and you're there. Goodbye. Meaning, obviously, with stimulus solos, if you've got 4,500 and there's money everywhere, it's super easy to get 4,500, believe me, playing that if you've not already. Um, so people are just respawning all game, like in the second to last circle, there's still like 50 people left. And yeah, people start dropping super quick, but because it's such a tight area and there's 50 odd people, 40 to 50 people, 30 minimum I'd say. I mean, there's so many angles you get shot from, there's so many people, it's so hard to gauge where people are in my days, what is going off. So hard to gauge what is going off and... 
I think that's why. I think I'll probably give it another bash when they add, you know, normal solos. Maybe even some duos. I don't even have a four-man party to play with, to be honest. Nobody even plays. My, well, my friends anyway don't even play this game anymore. Or PlayStation in general, which is unfortunate. I knew I was going to die there being stunned. But this gun seriously has zero recoil. It's actually insane. You're dead, my friend. Oh, my days. He needs some milk. What was that kid doing? What on earth? I think that's the strangest thing I've seen in this game so far. We're in a different game, by the way. This is headquarters now. I'm playing one more because I felt like that kill confirm game just didn't. Nothing even happened. It was so slow paced. Honestly, this gun literally has zero recoil, man. It's honestly insane. I couldn't. I can't. I forgot how good it was. Oh my days. Having a decent start to this game as well. Oh my what? Please tell me we've not got another sniper in our game. The last class up video I did, there was a sniper in my lobby and he was doing my head and he kept sniping me. Literally every single death was from this kid sniping. Oh my life. Oh my days, no way. That was the sniper again as well. I'm gonna play this save and no respawns. Try and defend this HQ for the team as the team is dropping like flies right now. You are gonna get beamed my friend. Look at it man, it's got literally no recoil. It's honestly insane. Oh my god, goodbye. There's someone in the HQ as well. Can we get him off the HQ again? Of course we can. The time to kill... Oh my life, we get killed finally. But the time to kill on this thing is super fast as well. It actually melts people as well as being really accurate. Oh my days, how did I not see that kid at first? Got turned on though. Trying to snake shot me in the back. I literally have no idea where anybody is right now. Oh my days, you're going to get absolutely destroyed. Oh my. Oh my lord, that kid was not happy he got killed by the cluster strike. Unlucky, my friend. Oh my god, you're sitting in the corner. Goodbye, my friend. We've got the HQ again as well, so I'm going to have to try and play this a little safe. There's only two people left already. Wow. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my days. This kid is Mike's causing some havoc for me. The pony guy. I'm not even going to really push the HQ. I don't think I'm the last guy alive. See if we can get any kills off the HQ right now. As I come round. Oh my days. No, you're not killing me. Cutting this UAV. You're definitely gonna push me though with someone behind me as well. You're dead, my friend. Oh my days, you're dead as well. Oh my god, no, I didn't kill him. I thought I managed to kill him. He doesn't want to push me as well. What is going off? He's closed the door on me. What is this kid doing? Is he coming back out? It's gonna come for me. Where did this kid go then? Oh my days, he placed the bouncing betty there. Wow, really? It's not gonna work on me, my friend. It's not gonna work. The drop shots are too quick. I wanna get out of this building though. I don't like being in the little office room. I really don't like it. Oh my god, goodbye, you snake shotting arse. People still using the snake shots. It's not gonna work anymore. I think, oh my, what on earth? How did that kid kill me so quickly? What the hell? That was unbelievable. Let's try and secure this HQ though real quick. Let's try and get this secured. Looks like nobody's wanting to push the HQ. Don't know why. Oh yeah, there's a kid there. You're gonna get lasered and so we honestly, this gun is the most accurate gun in the game. Say ooh. I don't care what anybody says, it's it's a laser. It's up there, it's dead more accurate than the M4 uh, M13. And I'm going as far as to say it could be just as good as the M4A1. But maybe even the growl. That's a bold statement though. Better than the growl is, oh my days, no way. Oh my days, you just got lasered off the head glitch. That was unbelievable. That just shows you how there's literally zero recoil. That kid got absolutely melted, wow. I'm surprised at how accurate this thing actually is myself as well. Why did I stop using this class at all? But what on earth? This kid snapped on me. Oh my days, okay. Do we have an aimbot suspect who spawned on him? Let's see. I don't think he does. Nah, he doesn't. He would have snapped on me straight away, I think. Oh my days. He would have definitely snapped on me straight away, surely, as soon as I shot him there. Maybe. I don't know. I don't think he does. I think that was just an absolute... I think I just got absolutely snapped on, to be fair. I think I just got obliterated. And this kid, Macman641, he's using the ramp. Let's look at this guy. He keeps, he keeps absolutely melting me. I don't know why. Maybe I need to use the ramp. It's melting the ram, to be fair. I get melted by it at least once every couple of games. God, what is this kid doing? Was he laid down? Oh my god, he was laid down in the crate. Is he still there? If he is, he's gonna die. Yeah, it looks like this is still, he's still there. I thought there was two. I thought this one else was laid down. 
I wasn't shooting bodies, I promise. I'm not that toxic. Even though I am that toxic, I would definitely shoot your body. But that's not what I was doing on my days. EOD. Oh my god, I, like I say, I always throw an absolute awful C4, and that was it right there. This is sniper in the head glitch again, isn't he? Isn't he? Get okay, goodbye. Thank god I got hit marked. No, I need to reload. Goodbye. Oh my days, there's so many. C4. Oh, it's not even gonna get anyone. Oh my days. Goodbye. Oh my days. Oh my god, this gun is insane. This could be my new favourite gun right now. You actually. Oh my god, the sniper, of course. Flobber. What kind of name is Flobber? And you're sniping me like that. He's insane, to be fair. I'll be honest, I've got to give it him. He's actually pretty decent with the sniper, but it's. Oh, there he That's not even him, but he's somebody else. Look at this Mark II carbines. They're so annoying. I've used it before in this. Well, obviously, I've used it before. I've got Damascus, but. It's insane, the Mark II carbine, to be honest. It's super. I'm not going to say easy to use, but if you're accurate, it can absolutely melt people. I've still not figured out as well how the timer works. Oh my god. Please don't kill me. There's someone mid map as well. Oh, there was. Oh my god. Goodbye. Where are they coming from? There's only seconds left in this game, but I don't want to die. Goodbye. Oh my god. Goodbye. Oh my god. Oh, that is it. I really don't even know how the timer works in headquarters still. I really need to figure that one out. Okay, guys, I'm back in the lobby. This ACR class up is actually insane. You actually need to try it out for yourself. Like, I can't emphasize this stuff. Out of all the class ups I've done, this one melts. Literally has zero recoil. Time to kill it is so, so quick. Honestly, you can destroy people with this class up at range, medium range, short range, any range. It's insane. I'm definitely going to be using this class up out more for myself personally. I don't know why I stopped, it's like I say, it's what I used at the start of this game, but it seems even better than before, make sure you're trying it out. But if you guys are new around here, make sure you are hitting that subscribe button, and if you are already subscribed, make sure you do have bell notifications turned on, so you don't miss out on a single video I do upload. Make sure you're smashing a like if you enjoyed this video, make sure you're following me on my Instagram, my Twitter, links to both of them are in the description below. Thank you guys ever so much for watching, I hope to catch you guys on the next one, peace.